Hi, everyone, and welcome back to Walk My Talk, my weekly video series where I take a chance and spin the wheel of opportunities and do whatever I land on, either live for you all or I take on a challenge throughout the course of the week. And I do this because as a coach, I'm constantly encouraging my clients to stretch themselves by 10%, do something that feels slightly out of reach, maybe something they want to do but feel like they don't have time to do, maybe something they've been avoiding. And I want to show you all that I am doing all of those things and walking the talk alongside my clients every single day. For those of you who are new, welcome. And for those of you who are not new, welcome back. This is take one, everyone. And hopefully it's my only take. <laughs> if you joined me last week, it took me five takes to record Walk My Talk, which for me, it... 99.9% .9 of the time is a one and done take. So I was extremely frustrated last week, but we are all good. This is take one and it should be the only take. A progress report from last week when I spun the wheel, I landed on ask for a referral. And I had said that self-promotion is really not part of my marketing it's, it's just not how I approach marketing. And I was very humble by your responses, your support, and by your referrals. So thank you all so, so much. I really, really appreciate it. Let's spin the wheel this week. I don't match the wheel. This is my first shacket, which my trendy friend says is cool. And uh, Amazon apparently said it was cool as well and told me to buy it, and I did. <laughs> Finish a book. Oh my gosh, I'm not going to lie. Thank God I landed on this one because I am reading right now. Let's see here. Let's see all the books I'm reading. Right now I'm listening to High Performance Habits by Brendan Burchard which is a great book. Um, I'm learning an, a lot. I am reading Open, Honest, and Direct by Aaron Levy. Again, great book. I'm only about a quarter of the way. And bear with me for a second. <laughs> I'm still indulging in Brene Brown's Atlas of the Heart. I definitely don't think this is the book that's going to get finished because I usually read this book about 10 pages at a time and, and it's just it's just nice to really soak in every last word. So I think my commitment this week is to finish high performance habits. I've been I adjusted my morning routine where I'm getting up at five. So that between five and nine o'clock is my time, my time to work out, get ready, connect with friends on an app that I have, and also do some personal development where I've dedicated 20 to 30 minutes every morning to reading, whether I'm actually physically reading the book or that I'm listening to the audio. And I think if I commit to those 20, 30 minutes every day to listening to that audio in the morning, I will get Brendan Burchard's High performance habits completed this week. So what? And this was the one that I was doing for my book club that I joined that my, my um, coaching mastermind group were all reading high performance habits. So I'm going to let them know that I will be done with it this week. What do you want to commit to this week? Do you want to finish a book? Do you want to start a book? Is there something else? Let me know. I would love as always to be your accountability partner. I think that's all I got this week. One and done. Whoop, whoop. We'll see y'all next week when I spin the wheel again. Bye-bye.